Hello, Facebook and YouTube. Um, this is Sonia here with you again with Real Talk Radio. And I'm really glad to be back with you guys with another pre-Christmas um, episode. We're really close to Christmas now, kind of only days away. So I'm really happy to get to do this uh, before we get there. And um, in the last one, I had my mom with me and she played a beautiful piano while I read you guys some poems. I'm going to read some poems again today, um, but actually mom isn't going to do it the same way. She worked out some music to put in the background. Um, it's not her music, but she found some. And then she has a fireplace scene. So, I hope you guys are enjoying that. Um, so hopefully it, it'll be relaxing, create a nice poetry reading atmosphere for everybody uh, to enjoy. So I did, I did want to share some poems with you guys. These are new ones. They're not in the um, Savior series that uh, that I put on Amazon. These are newer poems. Uh, some of them even within the last week, actually, that I finished. And I've been putting some poems on my um, Facebook, my Real Talk Radio business page um, <clears throat> on Facebook. And I've been putting the poems written out with a picture and seem to have gotten a pretty good response with that. And I want to thank you guys. That's been really encouraging to get the feedback. I uh, really appreciate the support and, and glad that you're enjoying the poems. And so I'm going to go ahead and start actually with one that I plan to put on Facebook. I have it ready and I haven't done it yet. But this one's called Let Every Yoke Be Broken. So I thought I would start with reading that one. Let every yoke be broken for the mind of living glory has spoken. Let joy flood and overflow by faith as we move ever forward in our race. How powerful is this glory? Heaven knows as the seasons and times of fulfillment grow. Raising the standard, we keep going until finally knowing it is into the kingdom, we are growing. Let every yoke be broken as resurrection is spoken until yielding within the glory of divine love, we are finally healed from above. Okay, so that's the first one I wanted to share. I hope you guys were blessed by that one, and I am going to put it on, on my Real Talk Radio Facebook page, too, in written form, if you want to see that. Um, this next poem I've called Follow Your Heartbeats. Don't be afraid to follow where your heart leads. Trust instead that as it beats with direction, it is leading you to that divine connection that you know you need. Deny if you must, but one day you will learn who you can trust. In the fog of confusion, in the pain of illusion, your heart holds the spark put there to guide you out of the dark. That's a short one. Okay, and I have uh, at least a couple more that I wanted to share with you guys. So uh, maybe two or three. Let's see. Um, here's one. Okay, this is a short one, and it's called Cry Out. We cry out for release in our hearts. We cry out for the hope of a new start in new garments we cry out to you with no need for walls now in these riches of glory we cry out for more as you move our hearts to seek filled with new life living life now at its peak okay some of these are just short and sweet <laughs> hopefully sweet <laughs> hopefully you guys find them sweet okay um, and the next one that I wanted to share, I think I've got two more. Uh, the next one is called Freed. Freed. Okay. Freed now from a prison of lies. Freed now from unholy ties. 
Resurrection has come and from beginning to end, the blueprint of God is at hand as God implements his divine plan. Freed now from prying eyes and the control of man, alive now and breathing anew in union with the living God, the one who is faithful and true. Okay, and then um, just two more. And again, these are all very recent. Uh, that um, I don't know. The ins I'll just be sitting there, and the inspiration will will kind of hit. I never quite know, so I keep a little notebook handy for when that can happen. Or sometimes I just put it right on my phone, and I'm always kind of at the ready. So uh, inspiration is really cool like that. Yeah. Okay. So this next one's called these fountains. These fountains of the deep make everything glow. These fountains of the deep challenge all that you know. Let your heart soar, let go. What will it take to make your paradigm break? These fountains of the deep now opened by the rains, these floods of glory that tell the story matter. So let your paradigm shatter. Live the life you were meant to. Let your heart soar, let go. These fountains, these springs of love were long ago prepared for you, heaven sent from above. Okay, and let's see, there was one more. This is, this is the last poem. And this one, at least for today, <laughs> and I'm gonna hopefully have more coming. But this, these are the ones I had on my heart to share with you guys right now. So this one is called The Goodness of God. Enter the goodness of God as your resistance breaks in the conquering force of love's earthquake. Who can stop a tidal wave? No fists that shake, no boughs that break could ever make a God of love forsake. Have you ever known such a thing to be transported heavenward with feet still on the ground? Yes, it is that wonderful and profound. So follow the sound of distant thunder and do not be alarmed if what you knew is now asunder. Instead, look around and see that God's love is chasing you down. It is no empty gong of release, but the sweetness of God's song answering your fleece. It has been waiting for you all along, carried on the wings of love's pure song. Only a heartbeat away, the goodness of God surrounds you more day by day. Run if you must, but know that those old fears that once bowed you cannot stand now that love and God's goodness has found you. Okay, and that was the last one, you guys. Um, I'm so glad you could join me and I hope everybody is ready for Christmas and um, getting everything you need to done and I am so happy I got to be with you guys before Christmas at least in this way and of course I'm on Facebook um, and and you can find me every day on my Real Talk Friends group there but anyway uh, thank you again for listening and from my family to yours, we want to wish you guys a very Merry Christmas. And until next time, this is Sonia with Real Talk Radio signing off for now. Bless you guys.